Ismomania, and welcome back to the Maniac Zone. We're here with another reaction today, man. We're just gonna dive right into it. We're not gonna have these long ass intros before the reactions. Disabled, disabled veteran catches wife cheating in the act. Cheaters get caught in the act. Disabled and you cheat. It blew my mind when I saw half of these. But today's shout out winner goes to William Colburn. Thank you for commenting, right. man. Well, let's just jump into this first one, which is just freaking crazy. Basically, this guy does not trust his girlfriend at all. She, I don't think she's this. cheated yet. I'm not sure. When she's going to Atlanta for some reason, we're... Forget that. Isn't that the yep. Peace. Seen that before. Forget I'm that. Peace. Thanks. I'm boo boo the fool. I'm going to boo boo the fool right now. <laughs> And now in this, this clip, it's the one I was talking about in the thumbnail and in the title, which is so sad. Like, I, this is the worst clip I've ever seen in my life regarding cheating. This man comes back from the military, from the army, to come home to his wife. He is, I, I think, disabled. I don't know, maybe he had something happened to him while he was out there. He opens the door with his family around him to see their reaction when he when he sees his wife. And it turns out she was literally in, in the act of cheating with another guy, and he immediately broke down. In the act to... He just falls off the wheelchair and he starts crying. Like I said, one of the worst and saddest clips I've ever seen with regarding someone cheating. The guy she was cheating with jumps out the window and I guess this guy's family starts cursing out this woman saying, how could you do this to my son? Just please watch. It blew my mind. They just did a two-year tour in Afghanistan. How you feeling, bud? Glad to be home, man. It was long, bro. I just want to see my wife. Come on, I hope this is the... Nah, they were they recording see your reaction? Two years in Afghanistan, you come back to this? What? I don't want to say anything, but look how happy he is. He's like, I just want to see my wife. He just wants to get home. And then he just has to open the door to this. Yo! Yo, he got scared. He just has to open the door to this. He got scared. Yo! Nah, that's like five seconds. Nah, he got mad skinny. Why he still got his shoes on, no pants? I don't even know him. Fuck him out of here. Nobody wants you here. No. I don't even know him. You got your boy out the window. You might as well just go ahead and go. Don't want you here. Hey, you know what? Let's go You done ruined our family, you tramp. Now this next one broke my heart a lot because this guy was gonna get married to this woman in two weeks, guys. Two weeks. I guess he was going over her drawers and stuff, and he saw something sticking out, and you guys can pretty much see it in the picture. And I guess it doesn't belong to him, and he knows that. When he started to question her about it on the phone, this sir, I'm just happy. I've come home two days early to this, bro. All in the drawer. We get married. We to get married in two weeks. Students with ADHD bro, they love these hours bro. studying. Like, as they're cool, but not while I'm reacting. But no, by all. Where were you at? You at home? Where, where? I'm, I'm at home right now, bro. Bro, what's this in your drawer? Where you home? What's this? What's this in your drawer? Bro, quit playing with like you. I'm not stupid, bro. What's up? What, what, what are we doing? Like, why are you bro, what you mean popping up? I live here, bro. We get married in two weeks. What you mean popping up? Why are you popping up, Earth? It don't matter when I'm supposed to get off, bro. I'm, oh my God, bro. You, bro you, I'm about to go crazy. I'm really about to go crazy right now, bro. Where you at? Now this next one is what? So blurry. I nah, bro. Nah, bro. Drop her. Drop her. This for it, but I wanted to still put it in the list because I really feel bad for this guy. Basically, I think he's in college, his girlfriend's trying to break up with him, or he caught her cheating or something like that, and he's basically confronting her about it, and she's not giving him a legit answer. He was literally about to cry. Like, it looks like he's literally crying in the video, and his friends are all surrounding him, trying to support him as much as... You can't your hurt, bro. No crying, bro. Come on, bro. Well, at the end, the girl decides to walk off and not answer any of his questions, and he decides to chase after her until his friends decide to hold him back and hug him. I'm like, you ain't gonna do shit, and you saying that you gonna work shit out, and you wanna, you're not gonna go out, and you go out fucking three days in a row. I hate you so much. I hate you so much. No, no, no. I hate you so much. I need to say something. 
When his friends decided to hug him, yo, I, I almost cried because that's that's a real as hell friend right there. And all friends should support their friends like that. Like, They're basically saying, like yo, that, forget her, forget her. She belongs to the streets. And I 100 percent agree with that. I mean, I, I generally feel bad for this guy. He seems like an awesome dude. Please, I need you to know what you Please, no, no, just let me go. Please, no. Hey, we're about to get out of here, man. You seen the video? Uh, that disabled one was crazy. Bull got skinny and ran, jumped out the window. That was insane. But you know, hey, it's more mania in the maniac zone. We're going to the top. More reactions coming soon. And I'll catch you in the next banger.